There were two of them, a man and a woman. Early thirties, I'd say. He was tallish, curly, dark hair. Did you get a name? I think she called him Steve or Steph. He was furious when she said it. I thought he was going to kill her. He took it out on me instead. Is that when he beat you up? The first time, yes. On the stairs. I thought it was my ex-boyfriend. But then two people got out. Stocking masks. One of them punched me in the face and bundled me in the back. We think it was Vince's car. Wouldn't that be too much of a coincidence? No, we believe they deliberately chose his car to point the finger at him. And it worked, of course. What do you mean? We're holding him here for questioning. Why did they beat you twice? Did you provoke them? It was for the photographs, to scare Alan. Hmm. Something else had worked, too. We estimate they made about £300,000. Split three ways, that's uh, quite a payout. You think there are three of them? I know there are three of them. So he paid the money and then they killed him. Poor Brenda, too. Lucky they didn't kill you. That's what puzzles me. Why are you still alive? Ah, oh, Sergeant Troy, come in. Everything all right? Fine, sir. Mrs Hollingsworth. Nice to see you safe and well. Thank you. I was just about to ask Simone where she was held captive. I'm not really sure. They put a hood over me in the car. I had to go up steps. Concrete steps. Block of flats, I thought. And the room you were held in? Small, dark. It could have been any room, I'm afraid. No, I don't think so. I think it was a very particular room. And I think I know where it was. Really? Yes. Why didn't you come and get me? Because I wasn't sure until Sergeant Troy walked in just now. You were held. In the attic of Miss Lawton's cottage. I'm surprised you didn't recognise it. Well, I'm sure I would have done. I thought you might be there when I saw the, uh, the chicken leg in Sarah's fridge. Hello, Mrs. Anderson. That's a lot of food for three people. Mm. And one of them's a vegetarian. Right, Sarah? So the uh, chicken leg was um, probably your supper, Simone. Are you absolutely certain about this room? Mrs. Hollingsworth, I've just been there. You've broken into my house yet again. That is outrageous, Inspector. And you've got some staying power. I'll give you that, the pair of you. But your story ran out of steam five minutes ago. The three people I'm looking for are Simone, her ex-boyfriend, and you. You for the murder of Alan Hollingsworth. What? Oh, that's good. Surprise and indignation all rolled into that one word, what? Trouble is, I've been in this game so long I can hear something else as well. Guilt. Guilt. 